The Ashland University Corps is required of all students and is a set number of classes intended to provide a good liberal arts education. So learning how to think actually involves a huge variety of different activities. So our core uh, tries to establish learning outcomes in all of those different areas. What this means for students is that they have to take an extra 44 to 60 credit hours on top of their majors and minors. Well, I think it's good to like expand your horizons and get a general education on like math and science. But I don't understand that why I, as an art major, have to take an aesthetic credit. I really like the fact that we have a liberal arts core. I think that it gives students a good, well-rounded university education. Whether they like it or not, many students wonder why the core is so big and why is it important for them to graduate with a liberal arts education. Plans are in place to review the core to see if it needs to be changed. This will be the first time the core has been majorly reviewed since 1999. The liberal arts perspective at Ashland is over 100 years old, but our current core, as you study it today, is only about 15 years old. The possibility of changes to the core is exciting for students, but whether or not changes are made, the faculty hope that students will see the value of the core. Never has so little been said about so much that's so good with regard to our core curriculum. Uh, it's one of the real hidden treasures on our campus. For AUTV20, I'm Rachel Gohart.